in a special or extraordinary way. If not an alumnus, this awardee is granted honorary alumni member status. Tonight, we will recognize two individuals, and these special awards are being presented by Emeritus WNCC Foundation Board Member, Howard Olson. Kristen Weedy, kind of like 
a little jewel that just dropped in on us. Uh, we needed a volunteer coordinator uh, for the Platte Valley Company's Marathon. And I think, Jennifer, for this year we, we had like 300 volunteers, I think. And I don't remember how many we had when you started, but it had to be a, a, a great number. And those volunteers, you know, all the way from law enforcement to traffic to to bike marshals, to music, to food. Uh, she had to conduct all the trainings for those people. She had to conduct safety meetings for those people. Uh, I mean, it was a, an unbelievable effort. And she just jumped right in and did it, and then did it year after year after year. And when she left, she left it in wonderful, wonderful hands. She also was involved in our comprehensive campaign. Remember how many times you me for a presentation. And she went all the way from Potter to Shad making presentations herself uh, and, and preparing Todd Holcomb and myself and Jennifer Rogers for our presentations. Uh, so, you know, Kristen just uh, did yeoman's work in that campaign, right alongside of us on our campaign uh, committee. So in a planned giving area, she developed a, prat, a database for planning gifts, and she helped to work to implement the strategic plan. The database for planned gifts, uh, pretty important. You know, you conduct a comprehensive campaign, and, and Kristen got it. She, she knew that that's what she was doing. She was out there generating campaign contributions because she knew that she was going to go back to those people for planned gifts. And before she left, she welcomed the $600,000 gift. And she left that in just wonderful shape for the, uh, when she left to retire and spend more time with a guy named Harry. Uh, so these two, along with another Jennifer, you know, for a while we had too many Jennifers, but we couldn't be straight. But, uh, with Jennifer Rodman and, and later Charlotte Preston uh, came in. They formed a framework of relationships focused on the needs of the students. It involved from both of them tireless efforts across the whole spectrum of college activities and events. Their families suffered, but they moved the needle for our WNCC students. So thanks to both of them for all of your efforts. Charlotte, you're the glue that held us together, and I just love you, and I know we're going to be lifelong friends. Kristen, you taught me about the importance of small moments and how meaningful those are, and it's something that I um, carry with me today, so thank you. You're the peanut butter to my jelly. And the alumni committee, our original alumni committee, I just can't say enough um, about each of you, but I'm going to try. Um, Connie Kramer, who's not here this evening, but she was one of the originals to the alumni committee, really taught me a lot about the importance of community connections. She did never know a stranger and had a ton of connections in the community and really emphasized the value of that. Elaine Pyle, you are so giving of your time and talents everywhere you go to every organization you're involved in, and I learned a lot from you about being more of a giving person. Judy Amu, you are a partner who really made me better. Um, you challenged me, you kept me accountable, you supported me and you encouraged me, and um, you were such a fantastic partner, so thank you. Coral, you taught me 
the invaluable, invaluable importance of history within an organization. And I knew when I got the nod from Coral that I was gonna be okay at this alumni director thing. She, she really was the one that I wanted to impress the most. So thank you, Coral, for the lessons that you've taught me. And then Kara Perkins, our sweet Kara. She really was the vision behind our alumni association and was the most kind, caring, sweet person. And I know that she would be proud of the growth over that we had over the years. And it really was an honor to know her and to really hear her vision and to receive her very important binder that I never forget that had the list of everything I should be working on. She also really taught me about the value of recognizing the stories within an organization. So I really thank you um, for sharing her with me, Tom. And then finally, I just want to say I am a proud Cougar. I'm also a proud Green Bulldog, and I'm super happy to have taken these lessons that I learned from each of you and to now be growing opportunities for my Green Bulldog family. So thank you for all that you do, and um, I really appreciate this.